going on everybody? Uh, so uh, we're halfway, more than halfway, setting up the second gladiator. Um, it's pretty easy. It took, this took me literally less than 10 minutes to put together so far. And I mean, I just literally took a break to make this video. Uh, but the rest of this will take less than five minutes. So 15 minutes tops to build this rack unit. Uh, it costed me $300 Canadian plus HS3. Came up to about $330 each unit. Um, they are $399 Canadian at Home Depot. But if you are going to buy it at Home Depot, go to them and ask them for a price guarantee because it, it is uh, $299 at Lowe's. So... Uh, unless you're gonna buy it at Lowe's, but if you buy it at Home Depot, they will deliver it to your house because it's an online item, and then you can just ask for them to deliver. Um, well, real quickly, I want to touch why I decided to go with the metal design prefabricated rack system as opposed to a wooden rack that I can build myself because this costed me quite a bit. Um, but the main reason is because I live in a rental unit, and uh, so everything I put in here has to be able to be unpacked and moved if the need arises or when the need arises in the future so um, a wood rack system would although be a little bit cheaper would not have that ability to be unpacked this can just come apart just like as I put it together it'll take 15 20 minutes to cup tape it apart and then pack into a truck and then take to the new spot and re reassemble and then put the tanks on and you would to go again so that's why I'm going with the metal racks. I have a few of them in here, uh, mostly Gladiator, but I'm also using uh, another brand. Um, I will highlight that brand. I just can't remember what it is. Um, Husky, yes, Husky. It's the next Canadian Tire Home Depot brand. It's pretty solid. Uh, the, the only reason I went with the Gladiator was even, even though it was a little bit pricier, it was rated for a whole 2,000 more pounds for the entire rack. So that was... A big consideration for me it was able to hold a lot more weight than I require but in the future if I do decide to use these for larger tanks or much bigger applications I can have the option of doing that and it definitely has the space for it uh, their plug-and-play I use the same center brace here for um, both racks so if you can see that I didn't use a second brace so it's also on one brace so I have extra brace which I'm probably gonna end up saving for a future uh, but yeah, this is what it is. So um, that's the little update I have for that. And uh, I'll finish putting it together and use the finished product. Cheers.